theological seminary out of Kiev, where it is quite dangerous right now. And this is a shelter which was used for over 150 students. Over 25 people had to stay in this room for days. You can see the conditions. But it was the only chance to save their lives from Russian bombs. Thank God they've been evacuated right now. And we came here to help those who are still in this city under attack of Russian military. We are located in Kiev, Ukraine, and as you know, we have full-scale war with Russian Federation. And this is my reality. We try to protect our campus because war zone, front line, is very close to our seminary. Until now, we used our campus as a refugee center. We had a lot of refugees and also we provided food for many people. But now we have to relocate to Kiev. But we continue our ministry. So on behalf of Ukrainian nation, I want to thank you for your support. And also I, I ask you to stand with Ukraine. We need your support. We need your prayers and uh, may God bless you all. It's 16 days of the war today. And we are working with brothers, getting some sand to fortify our office facilities so that people stay at least relatively safe inside. This is our team who are working diligently because it's quite a dangerous area here. We are in Pushavodica and the enemy is just one kilometer from here. And uh, you can see this is how we had to strengthen the entrance because of what Russians are doing. They are attacking. This is a suburb of Kiev. And the reality is that they shot missiles right here, right very close to the building of theological seminary. Наряд прилетів прямо сюди. На жаль, наш кемпус уже ушкоджений, практично немає, немає вікон. Це наша їдальня. Тут 
Треба перекрити. Це наш кемпус.